Feverfew, natural relief for migraines. Hi, I'm Dr. James Machino. Feverfew is a, it's a member of the sunflower family. And it's in the leaves of this plant are these active constituents that are very interesting. They have a lot of properties. And they're being studied now even for their anti-cancer properties. But these active constituents are known as sesquiterpen lactones. And of all of them, 85% of those sesquiterpen lactones are, is known as parthenolide. So it's a very unique ingredient, this parthenolide component uh, that's found in the leaves of the fever few plant. And clinical studies show that it does reduce the frequency of migraine headaches. Now, it's not going to abort a migraine that's already in progress in all likelihood. But if you're taking it on a daily basis, it can help to reduce the number of migraine attacks that you have. The evidence suggests that parthenolide, some of the active constituents that are related to it, reduce inflammation in the arteries, which are, and you see in migraine headache sufferers, you see inflammation in, in certain arteries in the, in the head. It also helps to prevent the vasoconstriction or the, the narrowing that occurs first. At the onset of, of a migraine headache, often the arteries narrow or they constrict, and then later, and then you get a release of these inflammatory chemicals, then you get the pulsation that follows as the thing progresses and becomes more serious. So these active constituents, like parthenolide, are able to decrease inflammation in the blood vessel wall and stop the, uh, that vasoconstriction from occurring in the first place. If you do that, you're much less likely to have a migraine in the first place. That's the whole idea of using it on a preventative basis. So if you click on the link below, you can read my short review article on fever fuel. All the scientific references are there so you really understand that the evidence is strong and where it came from. If you're a migraine sufferer, it explains also the dose and the standardized grade you have to use to get the efficacy. You can't just take any old fever fuel. You have to make sure the dose is right and it's the right standardized grade. And you also have to know there are drug nutrient interactions where it would be a mistake to take fever few. So click on the link, read the article. Now at machinohealth.com you'll see my other research review papers and footage from my live professional seminars, other downloads and videos and resources I've created. They're all there to help you lead a long, healthy, functional life. All my research review papers and, and teaching materials are complete with scientific references to, to make sure you're getting only evidence-based information on any health topic that you're looking for. So you should use machinohealth.com as an ongoing reliable resource of health and wellness information for both you and your family. Thanks so much for watching.